Boom, boom, boom. Okay, I have a vasectomy, don't I? I win it. God's like, shut up, dog. God's like, I'm about to blow out your building because we need motherfucking troops on the ground. We're getting fucking banged from all sides. Today I'm cooking something. We're making chicken nugget fuck towns. That's fantastic. What are we gonna flavor them with? Tangy, sweet, General Town chicken sauce. Then over here we have hot sauce and ghee. We are gonna make some hot sauce. And this is the heater barbecue sauce. And it's gonna fucking blow your ass. It's a three-way flavor fuck. You got the nuggy, you got the sauce, and you got the dippies. And we're age-gated. <sighs> okay, we're gonna take one cup of flour, all purpose. We're gonna take a half a cup of cornstarch, one tablespoon, bacon powder, salt to taste. <laughs> Do you guys get tornadoes down here? Good, good, good. I'm not gonna go in the pool then, it seems. Cause I love a dip. That's why I'm making chicken nuggies. Chicken nuggies love a dip. I love a dip, you're a dip, I'm a dip. I'm a chicken nuggy. Here we go. We have our initial dredge for our chicken nuggies. This is what's wrong with society. The boneless stick and chicken breast. Should be illegal. Fuck them and chuck them. This is why every man should be, uh, what is it? Vasectomy. Every man should get a vasectomy. And then when you find somebody that you love and want to truly spend the rest of your life with, you should get married. And then you should be like married for like five years and be like, I really love this person. I would like to bring another body of life into this world. And then be like, I'm going to get an anti-vasectomy job. And then you get to, you know, too many idiots out there. Also like, uh, you know, all right. We're back to chicken nuggets. So now we have our dry on. Now what I'm gonna do is add just water. Now we got the slur dog going. How much water did I just put in there? Your guess is as good as mine. Yeah, you want it kind of like that, like wheat paste. Because this is like a slurry, we're gonna go over there, we're gonna do a little bit of <laughs> Stab that chicky. Here we go. We wanna make sure our oil's the right temperature. 350, frying a tabachar. Bitch is hot, let's go. I'm lighting the torch and going into the goddamn fucking Mariana Trench. If I opened a bar, you know what I wanna do one day is like open a bar where all my fans can kinda come and just like eat all the food that I've made on the internet and then just like play pool and just get mangled. Okay, I don't wanna overcrowd. I'm gonna put one more in. What's going on with the submarine? Are they okay? Is that long overdue? Not really, you know, it, I thought it was really crazy like how fast people take just death and make memes. Fuck them and chuck them. Uh. I'm kind of just, as they're floating, I'm pulling them up because we're gonna fr double fry them. I'm taking that as my first initial initiative on when they're done. Come over to my house and have a chicken nuggy night. Okay, here we go. Chicken nuggies, look at all our chicken nuggies. Are you serious right now? We got to a place where we got our chicken nuggies first fry. Bah. Thanks to HelloFresh for sponsoring today's episode. A crazy schedule can make it easy to fall back into your dinner time recipe rut. Keep mealtime exciting with over 40 recipes every week. There's always something delicious to discover with HelloFresh. With so many in-season ingredients, you'll taste all the freshness of fall in every bite of HelloFresh chef-crafted recipes. Produce travels from the farm to your door for peak ripeness you can taste. Even though the fall can feel jam-packed, HelloFresh makes cooking a home-cooked dinner actually doable with quick and easy options, including 15-minute meals. That's less time than it takes for delivery. HelloFresh does all the shopping and meal planning for you. Ingredients arrive at your doorstep pre-portioned, ready to cook, along with pictured step-by-step -step cards. Go to HelloFresh.com and use code Matheson16 for 16 free meals plus free shipping. Offer is for new subscriptions only and varies by plan across nine boxes. That's code Matheson16 at HelloFresh.com for 16 free meals. Click the link in the description below. Now what I want to do is get all of my tossing sauces hot. 
So we need to build those out. The first thing I'm gonna do is make our General Tao chicken sauce. We're gonna take four tablespoons of soy sauce, a little bit of rice wine vinegar, a little bit of toasted sesame seed oil. We're gonna take a spoonful of some chili crisp. We got the same amount of poison, some sugar. Yeah, that much sugar. Like four cloves of garlic, fresh garlic. And we're gonna do a little knob of ginger. We're just gonna cook this down for a second. Very well balanced. You got some acid, you got some heat, you got some depth from the hoisin, the soy, the sugar, the rice wine vinegar, the toasted. You're hitting a lot of palates. I'm gonna just do chicken stock, and like a tablespoon cornstarch. Let's put this in there, see where that gets us. Look, there we go. So that's done. That's our first sauce. Congratulations! The spoon just fell in. Now, I'm gonna show you how we make a little bit of some buffalo sauce. I guess we don't have Frank's. So I'm making, I know that I'm making buffalo sauce without Frank's, but it's also a good hot sauce. Fair amount of cayenne, some garlic powder. Here we go. We're just gonna whisk this up, put in some like, you know, some ghee, some clarified butter, and you get this nice and warm, that's it. You gotta just get it warm for a second, wake it up. There we go, turn that off. That's our second sauce right there. It ain't Frank's, but it's a uh, sauce, you know? The third one, well, this one's already made because this is Matheson Food Company. You can get this available anywhere. That's not true. Just a couple stores in Canada. Maybe you can help me getting these across America. With hands across America. This is so fucking good. Oh my God. Math is a food nut gun. I'll see you soon. I gotta do a little bit of a tidy up. It's getting hectic in here. You can see that I'm sweating. <sighs> see you soon. Hey, show! Okay. So, so now we drop them in. We got the fryer at 375 high heat and we wanna fry these up nice and crispy and we're only gonna put in one row at a time. They don't get that much darker, but they get like these, look at this. This looks like a super nug. This is hot. This looks like the perfect nug, doesn't it? We are now going to add our heater sauce. Ooh, that smells good. America. Feel you like a lot of chicken nuggies. Yeah, I said it. We're doing a chicken nuggie party. Now, let's fry up some more. We're back over here now. Here we go, next batch. Chicken nuggies, fresh crunchers. Here we go. Now we are doing our buffalo sauce. Ooh. Oh, there it is, the vinegar. Get the fuck out of town. Dude, this nuggie party just turned into a nuggie party. Look at that, that is like a perfect little nug, dog. Now, drop them in. We're double frying. We're moving. People are about to start jamming on some nugs. Woo! Are we really gonna start talking about the big dog upstairs again? Thank you, Lord, for making chickens and giving them breasts that we can use to make chicken nuggies. Without the big G-O-D being like, yo, chickens, these motherfuckers love eating eggs. That's a quick video for free for you fucking losers. <gasps> <coughs> Okay, how you doing, everyone? We're here at the Nuggie party. I'm your host, Nuggie. Nuggieson. I just took these out of the fryer. I'm gonna start with my, um, here we go. This is America, a barbecue sauce, chicken nugget dipped in ranch. Our heater sauce with the ranch, insane. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Buffalo, Are you kidding me right now? Blue cheese, Are you kidding me? Truth be told, I never ate fast food growing up. I grew up very strict. Wonder why I acted out later on in life. Right now, I'm fully nugged out. If there was no cameras here, I'd body these. And then we got the General Tao chicken. Hot mustard, come the fuck on. I think we need to start having chicken nuggy parties. We just made a bunch of chicken nuggets. I think we learned something today. I think that I've been hating chicken breasts without really cooking them the way I should have. I don't know what the chicken nuggies in America are made out of, but mine made out of chicken breasts. And you can trust the chicken press. That's a fact. I'm mad, man, man, there's a cocky jump. Jump on your horse. Go into the sunset. Laugh off, baby. Like, subscribe, go into the basement. Tell me the fuck I did wrong, like you always do. Or tell me how much you love me. Actually, most of my comments are very, very positive. I don't know why I'm so negative and call everyone idiots and losers all the time, because you guys are incredible people. I've come full circle. The chicken nugget has changed me.